actually developed um, by one of our OEM partners, um, Pantech. And what happens here is I'm going to point my device at these doors. These doors are going to open up, and behind these doors I'll see an entire cemetery scene actually with zombies. Okay, these zombies are going to be coming at me, and I need to try and, and uh, use a gun and defend myself. So you'll see here, as soon as I open the doors, now I'm going to see the doors on the screen, and when I touch them, watch what happens. So the doors open, and I see the cemetery. Right? And I, if I look to the side, I can see way back here. And if I come to this side, I can see way back here. And then you'll see the, the bad guys start coming out. And I can actually play this game. So what happens with AR and with gaming is that my game environment stays in the real world. It stays anchored to physical space. And I move my device around so that I can actually, so that I can play. So we think AR is important for gaming. It's good for gaming like this. We think AR is also interesting for marketing applications. So now a marketer, because instead of having the zombie game, could create an interactive experience on top of their product, or their product packaging, or perhaps an advertisement for their product. And so I am actually a paparazzi. Okay, the player is a paparazzi. And the object of the game is to try and take pictures of the celebrity that's going to appear here on the floor. So this was actually done for the developer challenge. It's one of our developers. So you see the guy here, and he's just sitting there looking good. And what I want to do is I want to take a picture. So I get nine dollars for that picture. It's a mid shot body shot. So I want to go to different angles. And what I want to do is get, take the best picture I can without making him angry. Because what happens is he'll get angry at me, and he'll actually try and jump on my phone. So let me show this to you. So here he comes. So he jumped on my phone, so now I have to try and shake him off. And then you'll see he'll jump and take another picture. He'll now try and reach up and actually break my break my camera, break the device. So I think a very innovative game. Very cool. It was done with augmented reality. Yeah, let's see if you can see.